As you guys already know, I come, I've come back from like Ghana in Africa. I went there with the Lab Video Game TV and we did a whole bunch of things. Um, we've been documenting our entire journey to help build an esports infrastructure. And coming back to Jamaica, uh, we were really like um, charged up to get a lot of things done. Because you guys know that we still have our Just Dance thing to do. Just trying to um, get FIFA off the ground and get back into our swing of things and trying to help improve Jamaica esports as well. And of late, I know I've been very quiet. And one of the reasons for that is because my father passed um, as I got back uh, um, to Jamaica. So, you know, we ended the year on a great note, but the start of the year has kind of been, it's been um, pretty terrible for me anyway. And uh, when I got back, um, I got, I decided to call the hospital to check on my father's condition. And um, I found out from my brother he was in very bad condition and the doctor told me that whatever I'm doing I need to drop it and get to New York as quickly as possible because he doesn't know how long he can hold out and he actually was trying to hold out um, and he did as much as possible so I really tried to stop everything I was doing and get the money and get a flight and whatnot and that Saturday so it was uh yeah I think it was the second first Saturday of January uh, nine o'clock in the morning, he took his last breath. So my father plays a very uh, uh, influential role in my life as a gamer. Um, a lot of people wouldn't know about this because I've never really talked about my father a lot outside of this documentary I did with CNN's great big story called, um, well, they just call it Triforce at first. They changed the title later on on YouTube. But um, I spoke about my father and his support for me in video games. He used to play Pac-Man all the time, you know, when we were in the U.S. When he, when he first came over to the U.S., he drove taxi. And he used to play Pac-Man all the time, and he would always have the high score there. And none of the other taxi drivers could beat his score. And when I formed my Team Empire KDA years down the line, and my father was like, oh, so you're putting video games to uh, good use? I was like, yeah. And I used to name all my players. So, you know, I've named some, some key people in um, Empire KDA, guys like Justin Wong, I call them Marvelous. Um, uh, Samantha, I, I named the Persia, and so forth and so forth. I didn't name everybody, but I named um, most of the people. And then I was like, I need a name for my dad. So because I know he always put the high score in Pac-Man, and he was my father. I was like, I'm gonna name him the High Father. Now I know some of you guys are gonna be like, oh, you're ripping off of DC, but you know, I meant high like in high score, and it just fit him. So, you know, and a lot of those guys met my dad. You know, Justin's met my dad, um, Sanford's met my dad, and, and a lot of the other players who grew up in Empire Arcadia has met my father, and they known him as the High Father. And he was very supportive of me playing video games. He felt video games would keep me from running the streets. Um, of Bronx, New York, White Plains Road, so, you know, that's Jamaican territory. And um, so he got me my first NES, and he used to drop us off at, um, after school, he would pick us up, drop us off at um, 228 at the, uh, the grocery store. At that time, had some arcades in there. We used to play video games, and once we got our homework done, the, um, the arcade owner, the grocery store owner, was good friends with him. They grew up with each other in Jamaica. So the two immigrants, you know, working with each other, used to say, watch my kids until I come back. And while we were doing our homework and playing arcade games, he would drive taxi around um, the Bronx. So my father has played a, a huge role for me um, in gaming, but more importantly, he has played a huge role for me um, as a father for the person that I am. For all the compassion that I have, for all the love, for all the consideration, the pride, um, to want to do something, the ambition, all of that I've gotten from my father because he's a workaholic <clears throat> and I actually follow him. It's just I do it in my way and through video games and I've learned from DuckTales um, that what was that line that they said in DuckTales is like work smarter not harder. So I always wanted to emulate my dad as a workaholic but I wanted to work smarter and not as hard um, and <clears throat> I've definitely learned that lesson now because of his passing he worked so hard you know that stereotype immigrants that come to America 
they work two times harder they have like three or four jobs and so forth just to provide for um, their family and for the most part my father raised me and my three brothers by himself we'd go and see my mother here and there but she remarried and she had her own um, um, family so my father had to take care of us so I really got that workaholic I gotta do I gotta do I gotta do um, from him and it unfortunately um, led to taking his life but um, that lesson you know work smarter not harder is really sticking with me now and I want to work more now but I have to maintain that work smarter more efficiently um, my health is more important health and strength over everything the longer you live the more you can do so I've definitely learned that and at the funeral I gave his eulogy and uh, with my brother and then we took him out to the cemetery and he had a nice casket it was real good real nice and we said our peace made peace with him and then we buried him and that was it so now that he's um he's buried and he's he's at peace you know i'm back here in jamaica and you know his passing is going to really make me now work a lot more efficiently so a lot of the stuff that you guys have been waiting on we're going to get back to work and i'm gonna work a hundred times smarter so I'll see you guys with our next uh, piece in gaming at the Lab Video Game TV because our game is never over.